the necessity of aerial refueling is growing every day. Aerial refueling must be done quickly, but speed alone won't help much if the aircraft can't carry enough fuel to refuel multiple fighters or bombers. The greater an aerial tanker's fuel carrying capacity, the fewer sorties, as well as the fewer tanker aircraft required for refueling. As a result, an aerial tanker must be very large to carry enough fuel. But why the US Army use smaller aircrafts like the Super Hornet to refuel other aircrafts at supersonic speeds might shock you. If you are curious as to why, keep watching as we take a quick look at the 12 largest aerial tanker aircrafts in the world. Number 1. KC-10 Extender the KC-10 Extender is an advanced tanker and cargo aircraft designed by Air Mobility Command to provide increased global mobility for US armed forces. Although the Extender's primary mission is aerial refueling, it can also perform tanker and cargo aircraft tasks by refueling fighters while also transporting fighter support personnel and equipment on overseas deployments. The Extender has three main wing fuel tanks and three large fuel tanks beneath the cargo floor, with all six tanks carrying 356,000 pounds of fuel, which is roughly 55,000 gallons or 207,000 liters of fuel. During boom operations, the Extender can transfer fuel to other aircraft at a rate of up to 1,100 gallons per minute or 4,180 liters per minute. This is equivalent to refueling 100 standard automobiles in one minute. The US Air Force currently operates 59 KC-10 extenders with a maximum range of 4,400 miles and a top speed of 538 miles per hour. Number 2. Airbus A330. Based on the successful civilian A330, the Airbus A330 is one of the most capable new generation tankers. It has been tested in combat and has exceptional multi-role capabilities. As a new generation tanker, the aircraft's wings can hold up to 38,000 gallons or 142,000 liters of fuel and also carry up to 300 personnel. The A330 is the fastest new generation flight proven boom currently available thanks to its quick fuel flow rate of up to 1,000 to 100 gallons or 4,500 liters per minute. It has a ferry range of more than 9,000 miles and a top speed of 547. In line with fleet replacement programs, 60 aircraft have already been sold and will make ideal replacements for more aged aircraft. Number 3. Boeing KC-46A Tanker The KC-46A Pegasus is the most recent Boeing design tanker used for mid-air refueling of aircraft based on the Boeing 767 commercial aircraft. The Pegasus, which has been in development for more than a decade, now takes over operations previously handled by the KC-135 Stratotanker and KC-10 Extender. The Pegasus can refuel all fixed-wing aircraft thanks to its advanced fly-by-wire boom, which is based on the proven KC-10 boom and cutting-edge centerline and wing-mounted hose and drogue systems. The aircraft can carry 32,600 gallons or 123,636 liters of fuel and has a refueling boom that can transfer fuel at a rate of 1,000 to 100 gallons or 4,542 liters per minute. The aircraft was designed to have a range of 7,350 miles and a top speed of 570 miles per hour. Currently, over 56 planes have been delivered, with more on order. Number 4. Boeing KC-135 Strato Tanker For more than 60 years, the KC-135 Strato Tanker has provided the primary aerial refueling capability for the United States Air Force. The KC-135 tanker replaced the propeller-powered KC-97 tankers, which couldn't keep up with the speed of jet fighters and bombers. The KC-135 can carry 31,000 gallons or 116,000 liters of fuel. It primarily transfers fuel via the flying boom, 
but it also employs a special shuttlecock-shaped drogue to refuel aircraft with probes capable of offloading 1,000 gallons or 3,785 liters per minute. In just one minute, the tanker can transfer enough fuel to run the typical family car for a year. It was designed to travel at a maximum speed of 580 miles per hour for a distance of 11,015 miles. Of the 820 KC-3 produced in Renton, 732 were built as aerial tankers and 88 were modified for use as cargo carriers, reconnaissance aircraft, Airborne command centers for the Strategic Air Command, and transports for senior government officials. Number 5. Ilyushin Il-78 The Ilyushin Il-78 also known as Midas by NATO countries, is an aerial refueling aircraft derived from the Il-76MD military transport aircraft. The 78 is capable of aerial refueling three different aircraft at the same time during the day and night, with each unit having a fuel transfer rate of 500 to 600 litres per minute, giving it a combined transfer rate of up to 580 gallons or 2,000 to 100 litres per minute. The aircraft's fuselage and wing tanks can hold up to 29,000 gallons or 110,000 litres of fuel. Under field conditions, it can be converted into a transport aircraft capable of transporting troops, cargo and equipment. Only 53 of them were made, with a range of 4,500 miles and a top speed of 530 miles per hour. Number 6. Boeing KC-767 International Tanker The Boeing KC-767 is a military aerial refueling and strategic transport aircraft based on the Boeing 767. The tanker was designated KC-767 after being chosen by the United States Air Force to replace older KC-135Es. However, due to corruption allegations, the contract was frozen in December 2003 and later cancelled. The tanker was then developed for the Italian and Japanese Air Forces, who each ordered four tankers. The KC-767 tanker can be configured for multiple interior layouts while maintaining tanker capability. It has a fuel capacity of 25,000 gallons, or 94,000 litres and can transfer that fuel at a rate of 900 gallons, or 3,407 litres per minute, through an advanced boom system, and the wingtip air refueling pods can transfer 600 gallons, or 2,000 to 171 litres per minute. Its maximum flight speed was 530 miles per hour, with a range of 7,600 miles. Number 7. Airbus A400 the Airbus A400 offers the armed forces the most affordable air refueling because it is both a transport and a tanker aircraft. With a fuel capacity of 17,000 gallons or 65,000 litres, the A400 tanker can be outfitted with two additional cargo hold tanks of 2,000 gallons each. Air-to-air -air refueling is accomplished via two hose and drogue underwing refueling pods at a rate of 400 gallons or 1,500 litres per minute or via a centerline fuselage refueling unit at a rate of 600 gallons or 2,000 to 150 litres per minute. The aircraft can refuel helicopters at low speeds and altitudes, as well as fighters and large aircraft at higher speeds and altitudes. It has a range of 2,100 miles and can cruise at 485 miles per hour. Number 8. Airbus A310 Multi-Role Tanker Transport The A310 is a multi-role tanker transport aircraft based on the Airbus A310 jet airliner. It serves as both an aerial refueling and transport aircraft. The A310 is a two-point tanker with a standard fuel payload capacity of 15,000 gallons or 54,000 litres. The fuel is delivered via an underwing hose and drogue refueling pods mounted on the underwing pylons. Each pod can deliver up to 400 gallons or 1,500 litres of fuel per minute. 
The German Air Force and the Royal Canadian Air Force currently operate six aircraft with a maximum speed of Mark 0.79 and a range of 5,523 miles. Number 9. KC 130J Tanker. The KC 130 is a type of extended range tanker version of the C 130 Hercules transport plane. The KC 130J is the most recent variant used by the US Marine Corps, with 48 delivered out of 79 ordered. When equipped with external tanks, the KC 130J can carry 9,500 gallons or 36,000 liters of fuel. It can refuel to aircraft at the same time at a transfer rate of 300 gallons or 1,135 liters per minute. Number 10. Embraer KC 390. The KC-390 is a tactical military transport and tanker aircraft built by Embraer Defense and Security for the Brazilian Air Force. The multi-purpose aircraft can transport troops and cargo, as well as refuel while in the air. The plane can be quickly transformed into a tanker. It is equipped with wing-mounted aerial refueling pods and aerial refueling receiver probe supplied by Cobham. Its wings carry 8,000 gallons or 30,000 liters of fuel. The plane is able to take off and land on short and semi-prepared airstrips. The aircraft's full fly-by-wire flight control technology can ensure high performance while reducing crew workload. Number 11. Boeing F-18 Super Hornet. The Super Hornet is a multi-role fighter aircraft that received many advanced features, including five bizarre external fuel tanks, as an upgrade over the Hornet. As a result, depending on the mission requirements, the Super Hornet can also carry external fuel tanks. The Super Hornet performed admirably in the role, but it did cause much faster fatigue on the wings than in roles that did not require it to carry external fuel. Regardless, the Super Hornet is a highly adaptable aircraft that extends the range of the fighters in its formation without needing to tie up with any other tanker. Number 12. Boeing MQ-25 Stingray. The Boeing MQ-25 Stingray is an aerial refueling drone developed as part of the carrier-based aerial refueling system program which evolved from the previous unmanned carrier-launched airborne surveillance and strike program. The MQ Stingray will be the world's first operational carrier-based unmanned aircraft, providing critical aerial refueling and intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance capabilities that will greatly expand the carrier air wing's global reach, operational flexibility, and lethality. Much of its fuel capacity and range are yet to be published, but Boeing promises that it will be a capable tanker. 